What name have you given your child? Baron Sebastian. Baron Sebastian. And what do you ask of God's church for Baron Sebastian? Baptism. You have asked to have your child baptized. In doing so, you are, you are accepting the responsibility of training him in the practice of the faith. It will be your duty to bring him up to keep God's commandments as Christ taught by loving God and our neighbor. Do you clearly understand what you are undertaking? We do. We do. To the godparents, I ask, are you ready to help these parents in their duty as Christian mothers and fathers? We will. Baron Sebastian, the Church of God welcomes you with great joy. In its name, I claim you for Christ our Savior by the sign of the cross. I now trace the cross on your forehead and invite your parents and godparents to do the same. Almighty and ever-living God, you sent your only Son into the world to cast out the power of Satan, the spirit of evil, to rescue man from the kingdom of darkness and to bring him into the splendor of your kingdom of light. We pray for Baron, set him free from original sin, make him a temple of your glory and send your Holy Spirit to dwell within him. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Sebastian, I anoint you with the oil of salvation in the name of Christ our Savior. May he strengthen you with his power who lives and reigns forever and ever. Amen. And may you have strength in the power of Christ our Savior. Now we will we'll process in with... Also, with the danger of newness of life. 
Dear parents and godparents, you are here to present this child for baptism. By what of the Holy Spirit in you to receive the gift of new life from God who's love. On your part, you must make your concern to bring him up in the practice of the faith. See, that the divine life which God gives him is kept safe from the poison of sin to grow always stronger in his heart. If you are faith, Makes you ready to accept this responsibility of you now the most of your own baptism. Reject sin, perverse your faith in Christ Jesus. This is the faith of the church, this is the faith of nature. But it is about to be baptized. Do you reject Satan? And all of his works? And all of his empty promises? Do you believe in God the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and the earth? I do. do you believe in Jesus Christ, his only Son of Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, who was crucified, died, and was buried, rose from the dead, and is now seated at the right hand of the Father? I do. Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, in the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body and life of everlasting? I do. This is our faith, this is the faith of the Church. We are proud to promise it in Christ Jesus our Lord.